Hi everyone, welcome to day 30 of my 30 days SQL challenge series where I solve data analysis and business analyst interview question for SQL. Today we will be solving one of the interview questions that was asked in Spotify data analyst interview. So let's see the question first. Write a SQL query to find the top 3 most popular song by the total number of listens. You have two tables, songs containing songs ID, song name and artist name and listens contain listen ID, user ID, song ID and the listen date. So let's go ahead and you know see the table so the first table that we have that is basically listens so in the listens we have listen id user id song id and the listen date and the second table we have that has the song information like song id song name and artist name so let's go ahead and see the things that we need we need to find the top three most popular song so how do you define popular is basically the song that has the maximum you know uh, like listens right so we can say we need top three uh, top three songs with max listen right listen so that's what we need and then you know we can go ahead and basically use a group by group by the song basically id or song name we will need to join basically you know listen table just listen and the songs table right so let's go ahead and see how we can basically do it so you can go ahead and see we need which is we need basically let's see the songs table first what do we have in the songs table in the songs table we have the songs name so let's say we need you know s dot first let me just select the songs table which is i need first let's write down song name so i need song name which is from the song uh, you know songs table so other than i need basically you know count of the times that the song was listened right so that i'll be getting it from the listen table so i'll say l dot and uh, let me just check the listen table once so in the listen table let's say i have listen id so i can say l dot listen id and i can just say as basically times of listen right so like the number of time the song was listened so i need to use a count functions here because i want to count like what was the number of time this song was listened so then the song name that I'm getting that is from basically songs table. So I'm just giving it aliases s dot song name. Now I'll have to join two table. So I'll just use from songs table s s because I have used this uh, you know column as s alias. So I'll be using the same alias here and I'll join both the table using normal inner join. So and then I'll join this table with the listens table. So listens as l right. So now I'll join on on a conditions call on right so both the table has the same song id so if we just go ahead and check in the listen table we have the song id which is this one and in the songs table as well also we have a song id so we can join both the table on the songs id so i'll say s dot song id l dot song id right so that seems to be fine now i need basically for each song i need the total count of listen like what was the time of you know frequency i mean what was the time the song was you know like listen time so basically one one listen basically one time two listen basically two times so i need to basically count each and every records that i have in the listen table so i'll be using a group by by basically this column which is group by by this song name so that for each song i have the count of like the you know times of listen now i can just go ahead and run it they should basically give me all the songs name and their times of listen now you can see right all the songs their times of listen now i can simply use the order by order by descending order by this basically you know times of listens in descending order okay so i can just go ahead and run it now now i have the song that was listened the most which was uh, you know four times the second song that was third time and the uh, basically third song that was three time so and uh, you know accordingly so i need to find top three song based on the listen right now i can go ahead and say i can use a limit limit three but uh, you know the reason why i'll not use limit i'll show you why so now you see when i when i'm using limit i'm only getting uh, like you know like the first song which was this it was listened for like four times then the second and third they have the same frequency which is three three 
right so uh, basically uh, you know if i use limit that means i'm not getting like kind of like you know three song based on the uh, kind of times of listen they both are getting basically you know same times but this song is basically getting third rank right so we can use uh, some window functions to basically solve this so let's just go ahead and you know run it uh, for now i'll just comment out this okay so let me just comment out this and i'll use the window functions here okay and i'll be using something called tense rank tense rank and i'll do over partition by which is song name that's going to be from here to here song name and i'll do order by order by by this a listens time right so i'll be using like this this column now i will just name it as like as rank okay so order by by this count descending order okay now i can just go ahead and run the same query again let's see what happens so now what i have basically i'm getting a rank okay so i'm getting a rank uh based on uh, i think i don't need partitions here okay so i'll just remove the partitions because i simply want a rank on based on the this uh you know listen listening number okay so let's see if i just run it now i have uh, you know something called rank now you see the rank one this is the song which was listened more maximum time that is number four then the second song that was listened three times so that is getting rank two now you can see the third song and basically second song they both was listened like three times so they are both are getting rank you know two same rank now we are getting basically the fourth song which is song you know i and that was listened two times so this is getting rank three and the fifth song that was listened two times this is also getting rank three and the sixth song that was listened two times this is also getting rank three so what we need at the end basically you know up to rank three right so now we can go ahead and use a uh, basically you know sub query okay and we say we need uh, kind of things that we need from this table so that's one is going to be like i'll just give it as like song and i'll just give it an alias so i'll just say i need song name then i need uh, times of listens see i don't need this uh, you know column to show in my query right because this i have just created just to basically use the filter so that i can select the top three song right so now i'm saying song id count of times so listen now i can basically put all this query whatever i have inside in a in, in a sub query right so i'll say i need this song name and listen from where from a sub query okay so i'll just use a sub query here so i'll just say sub query i'm just going going to put the sub query inside it okay and i will just use just just organize it okay now let's go ahead and basically give it alias so as a sub query okay now i can use a where condition because inside this table i have a column which is called rank right now you can say rank equals or less than equals to less than equals to three right so then basically i'm getting the top three based on the listen i'm selecting the top three song and their count of listen so now if i just run it oops i think count so let me just see what i have done let me just recorrect it the sum mass okay i have deleted a comma here so that's the reason now it should work fine okay now you can see the song j that was listened four times so this is getting basically you know a uh, rank one now this two both the song which is h and b they both were listened like same times like three times right so they are basically getting the rank two and this uh you know song this three song which is i a and g so they both are getting like the two times of listen so I'm basically selecting all this you know three songs so if i say top three songs so i would have to basically select all this you know six songs because by the listen time i cannot define right if i select this one which is song j and select the select this one and this one so it will be unfair you know fair with this one because they were also having the same time of listen right so this is how basically you can solve any type of complex uh, you know query in sql so that's it for this video thank you so much for watching the video till the end if you have any doubt or any query do leave a comment if you have any different approach to solve this problem do leave a comment as well so i would like to see them